question from Pilar Sanchez. Um, oh. And Pilar wants to know if there are any games that they could use to entertain a patient who has dementia. Oh, Pilar. Well, um, hi, Sandra. Uh, Sandy Comstock is a great nurse, and she's been uh, a real help to me in different venues. So, Pilar, uh, games that can help with folks with dementia. Huh, that's a big spectrum. So the, the biggest issue is that you have to make sure that you're tailoring your, tailoring your activities to the level of engagement of the elder. So if someone is really high level, but they're forgetting things and they need you know, a little structure, you can't do the same thing as someone who's very advanced, who um, really has trouble doing more than one step at a time. It, I think if someone is early dementia, you go by what they enjoy and then what makes them upset. So it used to be, you know, you could take someone out to a restaurant and it would be a nice outing. And you stop doing that when too many people and too much activity makes them upset. And then you take them for a picnic out, you know, um, in the park. Uh, and that's fine until that's too much uh, stimulation. I think the activities are more related to what the, the person enjoys than the actual level. And um, I'm on the board for the Connected Horse. We will be talking about, my, my heart actually goes out to uh, folks taking care of elders in rural areas. There are not as many resources. Um, one program is the Connected Horse, which works with Barnes, and it's a, it's a program where caregivers and the elder who's got dementia can you know, groom a horse and learn about the horse. And I was thinking, oh, that's nice, but not a big deal, but it's huge. Because if you take, you break down the structure of the person taking care of the elder is always telling them what to do and is always kind of on edge that something's going to happen and you have a supportive environment, but you don't have to have that dynamic of one person telling the other one what to do all the time. It's so powerful. It's so healing. So Pilar, if you can do anything like that, you know, out with dogs, um, out for a walk, I think that sounds great.